Deer's new 8-hour series, which replaces the previous 80-30 range, landed on UK shores last autumn. Ranging from 245 horsepower, there are five models in the 8 r series, the 8245, the 8270, the 8295, 8320 and range topping 8345, each number corresponding to horsepower in accordance with Deer's new numbering system. In the tracked range, there are three models, the 8295 RT, 8320 RT and 8345 RT. In both ranges, power boost increases too with both wheeled and tracked top of the range 8345s boosting to 380 horsepower. All 8R and RT tractors are powered by a 9 litre 4 valve common rail Powertech Plus engine fitted with a variable geometry turbocharger and exhaust gas recirculation or EGR. Both models tested are fitted with Deere's Autopower CVT and can travel on the road at speeds of up to 42 km per hour. Other, smaller models in the range have the option of a 16 forward 5 reverse automatic power shift transmission. Although dry on the top, the soil we were testing on was fairly damp underneath, hence some of the bumpy footage. The most noticeable change in the wheeled 8R is the cab. There's no longer a right-hand console, instead it's been replaced with a redesigned command arm, complete with a new 7-inch command centre colour display. There's four times the storage and a lot more glass too. As well as the cab, the new Tract 8R has a whole host of new features. In fact, everything but the engine is effectively new. It's also the first time a Tract tractor has been available with CVT. Ride quality, both on and off-road, is improved thanks to a whole new undercarriage and suspension system, with each track having one air cushion bag and one track tension accumulator. The wheelbase of the RT series has also been lengthened by 245mm, or 10 inches, in order to more effectively transfer power to the ground. And the longer length also results in better weight distribution and a smoother ride. The tracks themselves are new, and are available in widths of 635 or 762 millimetres. Instead of the previous outboard planetary drives, there are now inboard drives, which makes tread spacing and adjustment easier. Both wheeled and tracked machines have Deere's Intelligent Total Equipment Control, or iTech, which replaces the previous implement management system, and there's an option to upgrade to iTech Pro for auto track models. In order to uh, adjust the tread setting on the RT, what we can do is we can simply undo the bolts here on the walking beam. We then use one of them to push the, the wheel clamp on the rear here. That then pushes the clamp out, which frees the whole track unit to slide on the walking beam. And in order to move the, the whole track frame, we can just simply go in here with a pickup with a fork truck and then adjust the tread setting from 72 inches up to 92 inches.